GH spoilers tease that Heather has shocking evidence in a new request. However, the explosive nature of the story is giving Laura a shocking new idea. Laura cannot accept Curtis's actions towards Heather. When she found out that Curtis had visited Heather in prison and shared news about the effort to reopen the case, Laura felt betrayed. She couldn't understand why Curtis would get involved with someone like Heather, who had caused so much pain and suffering. Laura is worried that Curtis's actions not only endanger him, but could also have unforeseen consequences for the entire Port Charles community. Despite Curtis's efforts to convince her of Heather's remorse and change, Laura remains firm in her belief that Heather should be held accountable for her past actions. This disagreement has created a rift between Laura and Curtis, making their relationship tense and complicated. Laura is using Ace as a tool to intimidate Trina to achieve her goals. Knowing that Trina cares deeply for and loves Ace, Laura decided to leverage this to pressure her. In a tense conversation, Laura bluntly mentioned her influence over Ace's life and future. She warned Trina that if she did not comply with her demands, Ace might face significant difficulties and obstacles in the future. Laura's subtle and cold threat put Trina in a difficult position, forcing her to weigh her loyalty against her love for Ace. Laura hopes that by doing this, she can manipulate Trina to follow her plans, regardless of the potential consequences. The tension between the two is escalating, creating a dramatic and dark atmosphere in the Port Charles community. Laura is beginning to see Heather's genuine remorse and decides to do everything she can to help Heather get out of prison. After many conversations and observations, Laura realizes that Heather is truly regretful for her past crimes and wants to start anew. Heather has shown repentance by participating in rehabilitation programs and helping other inmates, which has touched Laura's trust. Determined to give Heather a chance to make amends, Laura begins legal advocacy, meeting with lawyers and even persuading witnesses to testify to Heather's transformation. She hopes that with her efforts, Heather's sentence will be reduced or she will be granted parole, allowing her to start a new life outside of prison bars. Laura's actions are not only driven by compassion, but also by the belief that everyone deserves a second chance. Laura's determination to help Heather is creating positive changes, not only in Heather's life, but also in the Port Charles community where people are beginning to view change and forgiveness with a more humane perspective.